Hello there, Gemini, and welcome to your Oracle messages for whenever you guys get this video and it resonates for your situation, regardless of the date or time. Uh, keep in mind, Gemini, that this is a general reading. Um, keep your hope alive, especially when it's wrapped around love, romance, connections. Um, for a lot of you guys, it will be romance, but um, maybe it's friendships, um, whatever it is, okay? But I definitely see something here in the stars for a lot of you Geminis when it comes to um, a soulmate, a connection, okay? Um, yeah, closeness, intimacy, whatever. So stay hopeful here. Um, ooh, there's something here where there's a lot of respect in this uh, situation, so you definitely want... I feel I'm just seeing such um, like chivalry, romance, um, just something about getting really um, respected, Gemini. So um, I don't know what I was saying for the intro, but anyhow, um, if the messages don't resonate for you guys, check your moon, your rising, your Venus signs, or feel free to check out the past Oracle messages or SOS readings or pick the card readings. Those are all timeless. Um, yeah, so there may have been some, you know, for some of you, Gemini, something had probably, <laughs> not probably, there was something um, that challenge, that was very challenging for a lot of you Gem Geminis, but um, and maybe some of you Geminis have given hope um, when it comes to um, connections or love or romance, okay? Um, let's see what else comes out. <clears throat> Yeah, look at this. Hierophant, there's some type of um, higher level of connection or maybe even for some of you guys, there could be something here with um, staying hopeful when it comes to um, something very spiritual, something deep, maybe marriage for uh, those that seek, for seeking, you know, for those that are seeking that. Uh, Taurus energy is coming through here. So a lot of you guys too, I'm seeing respect for you as well. I'm seeing star card, I'm seeing... Um, you guys, a lot of you Geminis as some type of, you know, spiritual teacher or guide. Um, okay, so I do, I want to say this, there's something that is being spiritually guided and overseen for you. So have faith in a situation, okay? Um, some of you Geminis may want to seek out or um, connect with those, um, you know, that you, that share, that share the same belief and values. Um, if you need that extra support, but let's see what else comes out for you. I see a lot of you Geminis. Yeah, I mean, I already said it, but something about you being respected for, um, maybe even for your own discipline or something that you got, you know, that you really stick to here. Uh, take time out for yourself, Gemini. Life never ends and spirit endures all. So yeah, take time out for your for yourself. Have fun. Trust in your intuition more. You do have inner sight. See? Hope. Here's high priest. Um, be open to receiving. You deserve to receive. See, something about you guys staying open right now, being open to love, hope, um, mutual respect getting like six of pentacles energy too coming through gemini so um taurus virgo capricorn energy coming through so there's something coming towards you guys look keep your hope alive uh be open to receiving you do deserve to receive gemini uh the beauty in nature can be the answer to what you seek reconnect today so some of you guys may need to just go out into nature um and reconnect um just to you know, um, bring some type of, um, stability, some type of serenity, and also getting that nourishing, um, energy from the earth. So something about you guys being grounded as well right now, maybe a lot of you guys are in your mind a lot. Okay. Uh, so, sorry about the lighting too. Uh, let's see what else for Gemini. And this card like moved over here. Okay, yeah, so patience. A lot of you guys have done a lot of um, spiritual lessons and spiritual transformation. So have patience. Something is coming together. It really is being foreseen here. So have faith. Um, and, all, you know, maybe some of you guys too, maybe it is, um, you know, rebuilding your faith muscles right now. Okay, especially if any of you guys are... Um, you know, feeling challenged when it comes to staying hopeful or, you know, whatever is going on here. 
Um, yeah, look at this, sharing yourself. So I do get this like six of pentacles energy with this respect, um, star card, the high priest, sharing yourself. You guys are an incredible, generous being. So there's, so right now it's like, um, don't hold back on sharing yourself or your wisdom or, you know, what you guys are feeling guided to do. Um, let something take time here because it's going to happen as long as you guys stay hopeful and optimistic. Um, but I do see a lot of you guys earning a lot of respect for things that you guys really stay committed to um, and that you guys share, okay? Or that you guys are being destined to share um, in the future here. But a lot of you guys are already doing this. Um, what else? So it's like, you know, it's, it's like this beautiful flow here. Um, whatever you guys are putting out, you're getting it back in return. What else for Gemini? Look at this. There may be something significant with a child too for some of you, Gemini's, not all of you. Um, but there is something here with, um, you know, a strong union, a, str a strong um, success. I mean, we got the sun card here. So Gemini, there's something happening here where um, I do feel a lot of you guys just have to practice um, getting your faith muscles uh, strengthened here. Do whatever you guys got to do or focus on sharing yourself more. Um, you know, and taking care of yourself, taking time out for yourself, having fun, whatever you guys need to come to light is going to come to light. You guys are being shown. I'm just seeing you guys being shown your happiness here. So there's something about not having any worries at this time. Okay. Um, let's get a little bit more with the sun card here. Yeah, I feel some of you guys too might be already, you know, in the spotlight, the limelight or, you know, out there um, and sharing yourself. And some of you guys are, you, there's going to be more exposure. Or you're going to come into that. But I just see you guys really coming, um, like coming back full circle and really having um, your health, your happiness and joy back. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Yeah, look at this. Okay. Wow. Twist and turns. Ooh. So carefully made plans could be thrown out the window as major changes and interruptions surround you. Uh, make sure you guys get lots of rest to cope with all of the upheaval. So some of you guys have already been going through that. Some of you guys, um, there may be changes here. And so um, it's all to help you guys on this path of happiness, enlightenment, um, success, Okay, so I'm really getting something about staying adaptable and flexible, um, not getting too um, caught up in things not working out because sometimes you guys have to trust in the great mystery. And so part of the great mystery is going on detours and taking twists and turns. Um, and so you got to kind of just go with the flow here. Okay, but it's all going to bring you guys a lot of success and happiness. What else for Gemini? what this is have faith your prayers are manifesting remain positive and follow your guidance are you kidding look this is a high priest um that's someone who's following their guidance right and having faith your guide is here telling you to have faith it's all working out in your favor okay it's like spirit already has um, a plan for you a new dawn the, yeah look at this the worst is behind you and a po and positive new experiences are on the horizon mm -hmm. here's your positive experiences hope sun card re having respect having the connection or connections um you know feeling valued and being treasured so patience a new dawn what else self-worth, 
So yeah, I feel some of you guys, um, this may be a time, um, you know, to see, maybe for some of you guys, just see this alone time as preparation time. You guys spending time to really nurture, taking time out for yourself, um, knowing you guys deserve something. Maybe some of you Geminis have been just, you know, been working too hard or there's just, or maybe there's been something that happened in the past or challenges that have, um, you know, has Gemini questioning their value or their self-worth. Um, so take time out for yourself, okay, and build your self-worth. This is something that you guys can always build up, is self-worth, okay? I mean, look at this. We got the sun card. We got this new dawn here. We got this hope. What else for Gemini? Yeah, three of cups the worst is behind you so you guys are coming in you guys really are coming into um, positive experiences um, some of you guys are gonna um, be connecting with friends you're be, a lot of you guys are gonna be celebrating something new in your life here okay and rejoicing having fun I want to get a little bit more with this uh, three of cups for Gemini water sign is showing up here Gemini there may be something here too where you, uh, some of you Geminis will be spending time with friends or people that see yourself um, worth, see your value too, okay? Give me a little bit more with this Three of Cups. And some of you guys, there's like this celebration of overcoming um, a lot. So you're celebrating like this new life, uh, this new phase. And look, we have major life change. Yeah, the time is right for major life changes. Look, and we got the three of cups. It's going to bring you guys a lot of happiness. Look, as a new lifestyle or location um, brings great joy and a trouble-free existence. So whatever changes are going on, right, twists and turns, um, you know, take what resonates for you guys. But in general, yes, you guys are having major life changes. Um, some of you guys are going to have new friends, whatever it is, you know, be open to this. Okay. Cause you guys are going to have a lot of fun. There's a lot of, um, joy here. And I love that you're going to get the trouble free existence. Okay. Yeah. And some of you guys might want to, you know, you might want to start taking time out and, you know, um, making yourself look good and, and putting yourself out there. Cause I see a lot of you Gemini's, um, out there being social here with this three of cups. Okay. Some of you Gemini's need to be open to new friendships here too. Uh, what else for Gemini? Or maybe there is for some of you Gemini's connecting with your friends right now. <clears throat> Yeah, there may be a reunion for some of you guys too. I, I was kind of picking that up a little bit. For some of you guys, um, either, okay, there is some regret in a soul connection, okay? Someone is regretting some something here. Gemini, this is, some of you guys may have been dealing with an Aries or some of you Geminis have Aries placements in your chart. Um, so you may want to um, look at that reading as well. If, if you feel pulled to, but anyhow, yeah, we've got, there's something about a karmic review and judgment, um, mm -hmm. regret, and there's a soul connection. Um, did someone, was there a, someone withdrew from a soul connection here and now we have regret? Give me a little bit more too with this regret for Gemini. Okay, so focus on your dreams. Oh, some of you Geminis are feeling re like some type of regret or, you know, haunted by past actions here or whatever. So um, focus on your dreams. Allow the power of manifesting to start now. Um, so some of you guys, you guys have to be open to whatever is coming your way, new or old. I don't know, but, you know, trust yourself. A lot of you Geminis just have to do that anyway. I mean, everybody does, but... There's something about um, coming into a soul connection. Um, I was picking that up here, okay? 
So, um, yeah, I'm kind of, I don't know if I kind of get like mm, five of cups and maybe even six of cups energy here for some of you Geminis, but there's definitely a soul connection here. So this is why spirit is saying with this regret card, focus on your dreams, allow the power of manifesting to start now. So if you guys are really wanting to manifest a soul connection, whether it's love or friendship, you guys are going to do that. Okay. Um, if you guys, um, you know, for some of you guys too, there may be healing and um, a reunion or some type of reconciliation as well. Okay. So be open the, to that because something is, um, something is requiring your patience because I do feel that there was for some of you guys like a spiritual connection here. And so there's spiritual alert lessons and, um, you know, things and growth to go through. What else for Gemini? Did someone, um, hmm, take it if it resonates, did someone, some of you Geminis might have dealt with someone who um, may have got involved with other people or something and it was exposed or something for some of you guys, okay, but I'm not going to say all of that, but anyhow, there could have been influence, some type of influence either way, um, okay. Um, okay, so we got this card of health, an excellent time to start an exercise program or diet. Many new friendships are on the horizon. Are you kidding me? Because I was getting something here with the sun card for your guys's health, even this hope card. Um, and this is definitely in, definitely in sync with this sun and the three of cups. I mean, really? Wow. So yeah, many new friendships are on the horizon. Look, hope. Okay. So these are new connections. Wow, this is really like, oh, wait, no, I meant to say, well, some of you Geminis might even have cancer in your chart as well. So you may resonate with cancer's reading too. So take it if it resonates for this series. These are all timeless readings. Um, yeah, so there may be a focus right now on your health or, you know, making yourself more, um, you know, beautifying yourself and really seeing I mean, doing things that um, align with your um, self-worth, okay? Make sure you guys are thinking kindly of yourself and talking kindly to yourself as well. Ooh, signs. Your future positive direction, oh my goodness, will reveal itself. Here's a sun card. I was, didn't I say something about being exposed or something like that? Yeah, something's going to light up here. It's going to reveal itself. Any doubts and confusions will soon disappear. You guys have to trust this. I feel spirit is really talking to you, Gemini, very clearly here. You guys are going to see um, positive uh, directions and it's going to reveal, signs are gonna reveal itself, okay? So you guys are going to really eradicate doubt, confusion. Yeah. Make sure you guys are staying very positive, okay? Because you need some of you guys may need to be on your guard against any chaos, um, as unforeseen perils or emotional upheaval are foretold. So some of you guys, um, I was just seeing like nine of wands energy too. So I just feel for some of you guys, you may need to just kind of be on your guard here. Um, remember the spiritual lessons and all these things that you have learned here. But also I feel a lot of you guys are, um, releasing these, this difficult time here. Okay. Some of you guys do need to be aware of this. I'm kind of getting nine of wands, even seven of wands energy. Yeah. I do feel that as you guys are continuing to, um, really guide your own path, um, and doing new experiences and doing things that are giving you guys, um, an up level in life and feeling good and expanding yourself. Um, you're always going to not always, but you're, especially when you're kind of like transitioning and transforming or whatever, there will be these energies that, um, you know, that, um, can get triggered by your change and by your up leveling or whatever. So just, just have that kind of in the, for, um, you know, forefront for you as an awareness here. Okay. Um, because we do have like something about twist and turn. So just kind of have that in your awareness as these changes, um, are occurring. What else for Gemini?
Ooh, weight. Let's see, what is this weight about? And I want to see what this is. Okay, wait, ask for help for others. Yeah, there's something about people, help, friendship. Um, I was even getting that with the high priest. There, yeah, there's something with romance for some of you guys. So, um, but there's also something about you guys um, waiting because this Knight of Cups is waiting here too for the right opportunity. Give us a little bit more with this wait for Gemini. Something about that patience. Give us a little bit more of wait for Gemini. Oh my God, the hangman. Yeah. Okay. Some of you guys, you really are going to accomplish a lot. There's a lot of abundance. Some of you guys do need to kind of be on guard and protect um, th those things that are worth protecting right now. Um, I do see something about you guys being really clear about boundaries for some of you guys too. Um, but I do see a lot of success either way for a lot of you Geminis. Okay. Um, I do see you guys asking help for others. There may be a woman, it could be a woman or a man, but I'm getting like a feminine energy, but um, there could be a person on your path here um, that's going to give you guys some advice or someone that you guys can ask help from because there's something here um, that Spirit wants you guys to just really wait on, okay? Because Spirit knows that a lot of you guys are feeling kind of trapped and stuck in a situation. Some of you guys need to ask help on how to get out of a situation, so listen to your intuition, you know, um, you know, ask for, you know, the support and the guy that, you, you know, mentors that you guys really trust, like a trust the counsel for some of you guys, um, in a situation either to give you guys a new perspective on something or to get you, um, to help you guys, um, get out of a situation as well. Okay. Maybe some of you guys are just tied up with a lot of things right now. And so there may be something about simplifying, de delegating as well. Okay. What else for Gemini? And there's also um, a situation that I'm feeling for some of you Geminis um, with this energy of regret. Someone sitting in this regret or whatever. Um, you know. For some, it's like that patience because they're having to um, get enlightenment about a situation. And they could possibly um, be getting help from others as well. <clears throat> but anyhow, let's see. What else for Gemini? There's something with communication too um, with this wait and ask for help from others. So there may be something about asking for help um, or seeing a different way of, of viewing something here when it comes to um, some type of communication. Playtime. Look, the dolphins know the importance of playing as joy creates miracles and manifestations. So the more you guys um, actually surrender and maybe just sacrifice um, giving up things right now for some of you guys and, we, and just have fun. The quicker th miracles and man the manifestation is really going to work here. Okay. Because you guys are manifesting something here. Focus on your dreams. Allow the power of manifesting to start now. So play time. And here's the three of cups. So I do feel that maybe some of you guys, things have just gotten so serious too, that you need to go out and have fun here. Okay. I want to get a little bit more, too, with the Knight of Cups for Gemini. Give me a little bit more with this Knight of Cups. Family. So there may, yeah, for those Geminis that are seeking um, resolve or maybe even starting a new family or have a dream of a family, that's definitely um, a big potential here, especially when it comes to courting, romance, finding the one. <laughs> and for some of you guys, there's a person here that definitely wants or sees having babies with you or a family with you. 
Um, you know, take it if it resonates, but there's just also this energy, this soul connection that feels like family, okay? So you have someone coming on your path that wants to express love. I get that so much for a lot of you Geminis, okay? So be open to receiving. This guy is almost really shy and um, a little timid and scared to approach in, in a way, but um, there's something really just um, charming and sensitive about this person, so... Uh, what else for Gemini? You know what's so funny, Gemini? You see the hanged man on this net, right? The the mermaid or merman. Uh, um, wait, ask for help. But look at the big sword here. So that sword is going to be able to cut that free here. Okay. Yes, your intuition is correct. Take action accordingly. A lot of you guys just need to trust your intuition more. Um, if you're having a hard time trusting your intuition, just relax. Uh, take a moment. Take time out for yourself. Go out and have fun. Um, just kind of reset the energy. Just loosen up. Um, and don't try so hard to trust your intuition. Sometimes when you try to trust it too much, it can you know confuse you as well. So... Um, but a lot of you guys are really on point about how you're feeling and, and trusting um, where you're being guided to, okay? What else for uh, Gemini? Yeah, I think a lot of you Geminis would do really well with just really like nurturing and taking care of yourself as much as possible right now because, you know, you're being, you've got this message about a lot of um, changes, twists and turns. And so, yeah, you need to uh, prepare. Peace is just a thought away. Some of you Geminis, I just get that you guys are in your mind a lot, either the Eight of Swords or Nine of Swords energy, okay? So peace is just a thought away. It's easier said than done. <laughs> But um, maybe going out, reconnecting with friends, just doing something that maybe change up the routine or um, anything you can do to just get out of your head. Um, you know, maybe that's where you guys need to ask for help from others. Okay. Peace is just a thought away. You guys have the right to have a peaceful mind. Don't let something hijack you. Okay. I know that it does at times. You know, that's just how it is. But. Um, positive changes are taking place. Be patient. And look, we even had this card of patient that wanted to show itself earlier. So um, you guys have to trust. Major life changes are happening here. It's all happening for positive changes. Be patient. I know it's hard, right? And that's why you guys are feeling this. Okay? It's happening. Don't worry. What else for Gemini? Gemini. Yeah, look, fear. Interesting that it was on the Queen of Pentacles too. Could we, yeah, there's there's definitely fear here. I mean, we've got the card of fear. Some of you guys might be, um, oh, some of you guys, some of you guys might be fearful to really kind of come out and show yourself, okay? Maybe you felt you've been hidden for so long or you're scared to socialize or you're scared to go out there or you're scared, you know, how people are going to view or see you. Or whatever there is, okay? Just, just know that it's just an illusion, okay? Give us a little bit more with fear. Oh, some of you guys, it's something too about business plans or plans working out. Um, maybe there could be some fear about a level of success or a sustaining, um, you know, a level of success. I do see with the sun card and the queen of pentacles, you really being able to sustain something here. Okay. So don't question that. Um, go outside. Okay. So you guys need to go outside. I mean, look, take time out for yourself. Um, the beauty in nature can be the answer 
to what you seek. Reconnect today. Go outside among nature to ground yourself and center your soul. I think I even said that um, there was something about you guys grounding yourself right now to center your soul. Um, it's really those little tiny simple things that I think some people just don't want to do or they kind of overlook it as simple as like going outside, taking time for yourself, right? Like just take time to go outside, just to go outside. You don't have to have a reason. Take time to go play, just to go play. Okay, so um, center your soul and it's going to help you guys abolish a lot of fears. And I think what you guys are going to find too is a lot of these fears are going to surface itself and expose itself to you. And you're just going to be like, oh my goodness. Yeah, whatever. I don't know why, I, you know, why I was thinking that or feeling that because it's, there is something here with this hanged man and this fear that spirit is giving you guys some type of blessing on looking at something. And maybe it is reviewing fears um, that you've gone through or that are um, being projected out in the future here for some of you guys. There could be a fear about a person or people. Look, you guys have a new emotional experience here. And you, you guys have a new beginning. Some of you guys too, um, you're powerfully coming into creative ideas um, as well. But I do see something here with um, innocence. Again, there's something with a child for some of you guys or children. Let's get a little bit more uh, with this page of cups. You could be uh, receiving messages of love. Oh, okay. Oh, okay let me get a little bit more with the uh, page of cups um okay i'm gonna say this gosh darn it and i have this weird feeling too um something about jealousy here so watch who you trust with your personal secrets and plans spend time outdoors with nature to reconnect and replenish are you kidding me here so there's this card of jealousy here. There may be energies around you um, that are, I don't know, I'm just picking that up. Some There may be jealousy wrapped around you guys, especially if you're sitting here, okay? Um, so yeah, you may need to just kind of guard yourself. Remember that, that there was that message about guarding yourself. Spend time outdoors with nature. Okay, that's for real. Spend time outdoors and reconnect, it, reconnect and replenish. Okay, let's get a little bit more with this um, page of cups. Um, anyways, so I was going to say with the jealousy, you know what? Who cares? It's um, if, if other people are jealous of you, it's their problem. Um, and maybe some of you guys too, you've had, um, you know, your, you know, maybe there was some shadow work and challenges having to deal with um, jealousy, emotions in the past or whatever. Okay, uh, take it if it resonates. Give me a little bit more with the page of cups for Gemini. Oh my God. Um, mm -hmm. There may be a confession or some type of communication and that somebody, somebody may be wanting forgiveness, uh, Gemini. This is what this page of cups is. And they're actually coming from a place of um, innocence or I don't know want to say innocence, um, pure intentions. They're coming from a place of pure intentions. So I see something about forgiveness here for a lot of you guys, okay? Um, and if it, that's what you guys are seeking, that's what you're going to get here. So I, uh, I see something about getting messages, okay, from someone here that you've had a connection with or that wants forgiveness. So have patience. It is going to happen. This is definitely a soul connection. And I do feel that this soul connection really triggered a lot of personal and spiritual transformations, um, triggers, you know, whatever. But I see forgiveness here, okay? And something new. What else for um, Gemini? Okay, those ones just fell right out. Oh my goodness, we got the world card. Ooh, and we got your work, ooh. See, something about, um, there is something about your work or success here, sustaining success, um, something that you guys might be coming into with, there may be something here with sharing yourself with the world big time. I mean, look at this, we have sharing yourself. 
You're an incredible, generous being, Gemini. This is so awesome because I see you guys sharing whatever you guys are really focused and committed to, your work or something that you guys are really mastering and people are really watching you um, in a good way, okay? Um, and I see something here too where you guys, there's some, for some of you Geminis, there's going to be some type of like something um, from your work or something that comes from something that you're already committed to or focus on um, and it actually might branch off onto something else so expect some good luck though gemini's expect really good luck when it comes to success and major accomplishments with with your work um or something that you guys are like really really doing and mastering right now i do feel a lot of you guys it has to do with you know your stability your purpose um your finances as well okay the other thing that I'm seeing too um, is a situation where you guys have really um, are coming into this whole new world, this whole new beginning um, and having commitment, having work, having effort here and having some kind of new, um, new like sensual and maybe an app. Yeah. Maybe sexual pleasures or, um, you know, uh, experiences here. Okay. I do see a situation where someone wants to put effort um, either way. And I see a lot of you guys having a lot of success. Um, I got to say this too. I'm seeing it really and I feel it too. You guys have a guardian that's working closely with you with whatever you guys are like doing for your work or you're feeling destined to do or, you know, expanding on that. Something that you guys are mastering and working towards. Your guardian has been watching over you and working with you. Okay. It's almost like they really see and appreciate your efforts. And this is why you guys are receiving good luck. Have patience. Look, patience. So fishing requires patience. If you want to get a good one. Okay. All right. Uh, what else? Okay. That's it for those. So let's find out um, how is spirit helping Gemini. My, my eyes went to health here. So I do see a lot of you guys really improving your health. Um getting your health back for some of you guys, um, getting your peace of mind back for some of you guys. How, uh, how is uh, spirit helping Gemini? Future. <laughs> I love it. Spirit's helping you with the future. Look at the world card. Yeah. Okay. You may travel or host a overseas traveler soon. Hmm. Some of you guys, um, yeah, you guys might be traveling or you may just have someone at a distance here that is going to visit you um, or definitely an overseas traveler. Either way, great social fun awaits. So I'm seeing this card of playtime, the three of cups, the sun card. Some of you guys may have been so focused on your work and now you just need to open yourself up to the path of fun and joy. Um, so you guys, the future spirits helping you guys with a very fun, fun future and taking adventures. I getting that so much. So I hope that was helpful. Uh, Gemini, uh, love and light. Take care.